Right, day four of moon phase. Uh, by now you're starting to see a trend of starting with that fully short range. The idea is trying to get a fully maximal contraction in that range to make sure that we can feel the muscle, there's nothing else taking over, and we've got really good solid contractions for the rest of the workout. So in this chest workout, obviously nothing different. We're trying to make sure that we're locking our scapula in place and nothing else moves. If you feel like that's been an issue throughout the program, start with that cable row again and make sure you're really locking your lats down. Uh, ideally, later on down the track, it will be more of a lower traps focus. But again, if you can just get an idea of locking those traps in, uh, sorry, your whole back in and making sure your shoulders aren't rolling forward it's going to be the biggest help on your chest training um, just trying to and then from here what obviously we're trying to do is initiate with that chest we're trying to feel that through the whole range and make sure that dragging of the arm across your body is your focus and not just pressing things away okay so uh, again i've chucked the bench behind me rather than just doing the standing it's the idea of just making sure that you lock your body in place and nothing else does the work it's just if the more you can do is get your scapula locked in the better it should be for you so we're going to make our arms all locked in, shoulders are all locked back, and we're just trying to think of squeezing your chest across. So we're trying to think about trying to drive your bicep or your elbow across your body, squeeze your chest and drive in. Okay. If this is hard for you to feel your chest, all I do is start with a nice bridge here, really feel a contraction of your chest, engage your back, think about pulling your shoulders back to here, squeeze your chest, and then pull back in. As you feel that, we can start coming a little bit wider, squeeze, drive it in, and then you'll slowly work yourself to full range. Don't worry about trying to go so far back, you'll find you can only feel your shoulders, it's really hard to feel your contraction until you've really nailed it. So just really shock, drive your shoulders back on the bench, feel your chest first, and drive that together. All you're trying to think is about those elbows, yeah?